Sock slider is a device that allows you to put on and take off socks more easily. That's today's review, so let's check it out. Sock slider consists of two pieces. You have the base and you've got the handle. To use sock slider, you put your sock over this opening. And you lower it to the floor, you put your foot through there, and the sock is supposedly going to be on your foot without having to bend over. You can also use this handle to take the socks off and use it as a shoehorn. So I'm going to try it with a couple different types of socks and see how it works. Sock slider is supposed to be good for people who have problems with their back, their knees, pregnant women, or anybody that has a problem bending over. They say it can be used with dress socks, casual socks, athletic socks, or compression socks. So I'm going to do my best to try it with as many socks as I can and see how it actually works. All right, first you're supposed to put the sock slider up on your lap and put the socks over it. I've got a bunch of different socks over here. I've got tighter ones, looser ones, shorter ones, longer ones. So I'm going to try just starting off with just a regular pair of these Reebok socks. So what you're supposed to do is place it over the opening like this and kind of push it downward so it's like it's like that. Then you're supposed to take the handle and lower it down to the floor. Okay. Then what you're supposed to do is put your foot in there And voila, maybe not. Let me try that again. This time what I'll do is I'll, I'll bunch it up more like this. And how would I do that? Like that maybe. All right. Try this again. It's kind of an awkward angle too. Woohoo! What do you know? That's one sock. Let's try the other one. It's getting there. Ah, there you go. I did it. It seems like the key to these song socks are a little bit longer is you don't want to have too much of the toe in the hair. You want to try to wrap them around there as much as you can. I got a few more to try, so let's see how they go. What I'm going to try next are some short athletic socks to just go to the ankle and see how they work. Okay, well, that one pretty good. Let's try the next one. Short ones went really well, didn't have to worry about the toes being long. So let me try a pair of very long socks. This is the longest pair of socks that I have that I could find. So I'm going to see how well they go in the sock slider. Now, I think if you just put it on like this, there's going to be too much, there's going to be too much toe there and you're only going to, it's going to be hanging off. You're going to have to kind of work this up a little bit. This itself is a little bit awkward to do, but. Okay. It's a little bit off center, but maybe that'll still work. Let's try. Hmm. Okay. Oh. That, was, that was actually effort. Now it's still a little bit, I got a little bit of this here, hello which I'd still have to reach down and pull that up a little bit, I think. Now, let me try the other foot. Ah, okay. That one I need a little bit better. All right, I had to go back to the drawing board and kind of practice a little bit because it still seems kind of awkward to me. I'm going to keep trying. Next up, I wanted to try a pair of socks I did last year, which is a 35 below socks. Let's see how well they do on the sock slider. And really, you're just supposed to push this over like that as far as you can. 
and then, well, if you can't bend over, you're going to use the handle to place it on the floor, and then stick your sock, your foot through the sock. This part is awkward to me. I haven't really found a, an angle that I like yet. And like right now, the sock seems almost stuck. Ah, uh, okay. Well, once it's on, it's on pretty good. So that's a good thing. Now, I can't bend over, so I'll pick this up. Try sock number two. Like that. Oh yeah, I can't bend over. Now for the left foot. Uh, okay. Well, there you go. I did it. So to me, I think the biggest test for sock slider would be compression socks. So I picked up a pair of copper fit compression socks and I gave it a shot. My first attempt was kind of a fail, but my, by my second attempt, I figured out how to make it work and here's what happened. All right, I've got this copper fit compression sock. We'll see how it goes. Normally you put the socks on like this, but obviously there's too much hanging out the bottom. So you're gonna have to try now these are graduated compression socks, which means they're tighter down here than they are up here. So as I try to put more and more on the sock slider, it's going to get tighter and tighter. And what I've noticed, because I've practiced this a few times, is the more that I put on here, it's actually pressing the sides kind of together. I'm not convinced compression socks are really feasible on the sock slider, to be honest. I'm trying to work as much as I can up on here. I still got a ways to go though. It's, it's slipping off as fast as I'm putting it on there. And this is for one sock. I still have a, a second one to go if I even get this one on successfully. I'm making a little bit of progress. I got that much on there, but I still have all this. Let me see what happens if I just put that much on. Let me see what happens. I mean, I'm not gonna get my toe all the way in there, but let's just see if I can even get that much on. Well, yeah, I mean, I got, I got the easy part on. This is where the compression isn't so much. Down here where it's more compression, that's how it's supposed to go. See, that's, that's the easy part. When you have a small sock, that's all you really have to do. But when you got these long ones like that, you're gonna have to try to keep putting it more and more around it there might be a technique that I'm not doing that's... Oh, I, I got more, hey, I've got more progress this time. My technique is I'm using my thumbs and I'm pulling outward. Oh wait, here. I got, I got most of it. Ugh. All right, I think I actually got the toe up here. Compression socks, take two. Oh, I think I got it. Oh, now it's, now it's like stuck here. But I guess that's what this is for here. Hey, I actually did it. Not completely straight. It's not perfect. 
but I actually did it. There were instances when I had longer socks where my toe didn't get to the very end of the sock, so I had to put them on a second time. Uh, on one occasion, the device actually fell apart. Overall, I think the sock slider is a pretty good product. It works pretty well with shorter socks. Now, longer socks and compression socks are a little bit more effort. It takes a little bit more work to get the sock over this device. And for some people, it might be more problem than it's worth, but for some people, it might be a great find. Have you used Sock Slider or something like it? Let me know what you think in the comments below. And please subscribe for more As Seen on TV product reviews from me, James White, with Freakin' Reviews.